attack you with a spider tank. Power level five. I defend with level six lawn ninja. <laughs> Sucker, you fell right into my trap. <laughs> You're exterminated. No, 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 <laughs> Your reactor slapped me some skin. <laughs> That's right, kids. Exterminator trading cards are here. There's Reactor, Shell Shock, the Eviscerator, and your favorite Exterminator, Ace Hardlight. Collect them all and exterminate your friends today. show for you! On today's episode, Team Darkstar has been dropped onto the hellish alien world of Serapos. Their ultimate goal, destroy a monstrous alien creature known as the King Leviathan. And take it from me, people, monstrous is putting it nicely. Ratchet, there is a con... That arena up ahead, that is your first objective. Be careful, the outside is heavily guarded. are a good long-range weapon which can be zoomed in to accurately shoot enemies from far away. Try using the fusion rifle to destroy those enemies. Behind the arena, this could be nothing. It's nothing, he's getting ammo. You can order a bot to hack into one of those ore blocks.
close one. One false move, and those alien suckers will be eating your head for lunch. Mmm. My mother used to serve Lomax brains for breakfast with eggs and salsa. Mm. Yikes! Remind me never to eat at your house. Double swing shot. I cannot bear to look. this swamp before I start rusting up. In order to advance to the Leviathan Lair, Team Darkstar must capture three control nodes.
He's completed the third stage. Tell him what he's won, Juanita. He's won an all-expense-paid trip to the Leviathan's Lair, where he will enjoy golf, tennis, fine dining, and an agonizing death as he is slowly dissolved by stomach acids in the Leviathan's colon. moments before the epic showdown with the King Leviathan, Team Darkstar must hack all the orbs to wake up that big fella. Happy hunting! Mmm, I am breathless with anticipation. Sure you're not just breathless because you get to sit up here next to me? No, but that does explain why I'm feeling nauseous. To gain more experience or earn more bolts, you can return to any challenge you have already completed.
angry pack of leviathans for Team Dark Star to battle. They'll have to destroy them all before time runs out. For a Vox Sports Update, Dreadzone's Extermination of the Day Award goes to Shellshock for his 360 Tomahawk finishing move on Plutonium Jones. It was a beauty, Dallas, and it marks Shellshock's third extermination of the season. At fourth, actually, the Omega Twins count as two. Good points. And we're now live with Shellshock for comments. Shellshock? <laughs> Those Omega Twins went down like me little girly man. <laughs> yes, quite ironic, especially since they were actually teenage girls. <laughs> yeah, ironic. Hey, Juanita, are you wearing Ace Hardlight underwear? <laughs> and now for a heartwarming story in entertainment news. Courtney Gears has made a remarkable recovery. After a near-death experience last year when she was attacked by two psychotic fans. Ah, poor girl. You know, you just hate to see that kind of senseless violence. It's a calling, Dallas. I'd just like to take those two creeps and... <laughs> I'm sure we all would, Juanita. And you may just get your wish because those very evildoers are about to come face to face with the mighty Shellshock. Catch it all live on Red Zone. Tonight from the planet of Kronos, where Commander Shellshock and his army have taken over the city and don't like visitors. Ratchet will fight to keep Team Darkstar alive while Clink tries not to get him lost. What? Clink? Clank? Well, Clank, that's what I said. Well, you know, it doesn't matter, because Team Darkstar is about to become Team Dead Star. <laughs> oh, will they survive long enough to enter the foreboding Dark Cathedral? If so, Shellshot will be there to finish them off for good. Place your bets, everybody, because we're going straight to the action. The cathedral is complete. Locked down, but I have found a weakness. Two giant star lights lie dormant nearby. If you activate them, their beams will trigger a solar sensor. The temple and unlock the door. According to my nav grid, the spotlights are in separate sections of the city. Good luck, Ratchet.
jump onto the grind rail to traverse this gap. must now traverse a grind rail suspended hundreds of feet above the water. Is that even safe? Of course it's not! This is Dread Zone, baby! spot to use the hollow shield launcher. Jump onto the grind rail to traverse this gap.
tensions heating up as Team Dark Star lights up the spotlights that will unlock the Dark Cathedral of Kronos. A treacherous path lies ahead as Dread Zone's deadliest warriors will be waiting to ambush them! Oh, baby, I love this job! Ratchet, there is a magnetic lift up ahead. It will take you up the road that leads to the next stadium. said getting into that cathedral was easy. I did? Well, that was then and this is now, huh? Team Darkstar will have to fight their way through a series of increasingly deadly arenas. Bet they didn't see that coming. Initiate Annihilation Program! As you know, Shellshock's brain was destroyed by a cruise missile in the Obani Moon War. His brain was later replaced with an AI chip taken from a coffee machine. As a result, he is totally impervious to pain. But I understand he makes a fantastic cappuccino. is on the final stretch. This road leads right to the gates of the Dark Cathedral of Kronos, but it's chock full of twists, turns, and baddies that'll make your mother weep. Let's go to the action.
guess this is a bad time to mention that I'm afraid of heights. Might be a good spot for a grind cable, boss. Darkstar has made it inside the Dark Cathedral of Kronos. It's cold, it's dank, it's scary, it's just like my ex-wife. Take a good long last look at Team Darkstar, folks, because Shellshock is about to plaster them all over these cathedral walls. I call this one my dishonorable discharge. Did you know that Shellshock was recently named the sexiest robot alive by Vox Magazine?
Initiate annihilation program! Annihilation program! I will clean my armor with your face! I could use one my dishonor with discharge! Celebrating like, like, like I won the freaking lottery! Uh, remind me why I put up with these morons. Who else would watch Vox News? Temptation Asteroid? Galaxy's Funniest Decapitations? Yeah, yeah. Queer Eye for the Tyranoid? I get it! Seems we've underestimated our Lumbax friend. He got lucky. Shellshock was too slow and too stupid to be an exterminator. He should have been retired years ago. Well, he's retired now. Ratchet, however, huh. he just may be useful. He's even more popular than you were back in your heroic youth. Come to think of it, he even reminds me of you. I said he got lucky. His luck won't last forever. Security orbs, or the arena walls will collapse on top of you. And watch your back. 
Red Zone will send wave after wave of enemies in your direction. challenge brings us back to the days of classic arena combat. An old-fashioned arena death match, just like Mom used to make.
Clank, did you see me out there against that shell shot guy? Yeah, I saw. Ah, yeah. You worry me, Ratchet. <laughs> Come on, Clank. Can't I just enjoy the moment? Do you realize how many other heroes they have killed? Here, watch this. And now for a Vox News action update. The new season of Dread Zone is underway and on pace to break ratings records once again. This year's contestants include the notorious mafia crime boss known as Ratchet, seen here at his Mokhtar estate. And to think that other networks actually call him a hero. It's truly sad, Dallas. Other notable contestants include Ratchet's ruthless robotic accomplice, Clank. Oh, I never did like the look of him, Juanita. I'm just glad he's off the streets, Dallas. And lucky for us, the Vox All-Star Exterminator crew is headed once again by five-time grand champion Ace Hardlight. Last season, Ace shot the galaxy by terminating a record 13 contestants, including Captain Starshield, the Brown Ranger, and Mad Monkey McKnight. Dread Zone's six trillion fans are in for some unbelievable action over the coming weeks. They certainly are, Dallas. Yeah, I remember hearing about Ace Hardlight when I was a kid. He was this famous hero who disappeared. That must have been someone else. Why would a hero kill other heroes for money? Not money, Tin Man. Fun. I do not understand. <laughs> you traitor! Do you think this is some kind of game? That's exactly what it is, Furball. And you're going to be the star of my highlight reel. <laughs> I'll see you soon, Lombax. Hey, Ratchet. I know you're busy with the fighting and the jumping and the hurting, but I have a new bot upgrade for you. is hot in the Battle Dome as Ratchet takes on the Avenger Tournament. If he can survive this grueling series of challenges, he will earn the rank of Avenger. Get ready for the speed round. Oh, the humanity.
Battle Dome is shaking with excitement. Get ready to watch Team Dark Star fight for survival as they make their way to the Tower of Power!
Ratchet has reached the top of the Tower of Power. He may be the first contestant to do so in the history of Dread Zone. Juanita, what do you think about that? fortune selling cigarettes to children, Ratchet went on to pilot a tanker ship for Zexon. A week later, Ratchet got drunk and crashed his tanker into the ocean world of Equados. Who can forget these graphic images of baby seers smothered in radioactive waste? Ah! <laughs> Little Coco never had a chance. How could you? What did Little Coco ever do to you? Wh what? Al, how can you believe these ridiculous lies? Uh, no. I was just, uh, uh you know, I mean... Come uh, on, guys. We need to get out of here before we all wind up dead. What's the plan? I have been chatting with a tech droid on the operations level. She may be able to provide the blueprints for these deadlock collars. That's great! But we must be very careful. Fox has eyes everywhere. Challenge mode is downright nasty, Juanita. Our contestants must destroy every enemy without getting so much as a scratch. His work cut out for him this time, Juanita. He starts the round with only a wrench for protection. 